Um, so this is Sergio right here. This is my partner. Finally got someone to help me out. But I was trying to say yesterday, I guess it didn't it didn't record the sound. But the the homeowner he had two he had two uh, limbs, branches hanging above the roof and here above the driveway. See that? Above the driveway? Well, he wanted to, he wanted to take those down and uh, he wa uh, he wanted me kind of shape the tree. I just told him I told him uh, I'll work around. From this point I'll work around, try to keep it even. Um, <clears throat> he kind of wanted to top it, but I recommended him to to take it back to the laterals. So that's what I'm doing. I'm just finding laterals. It's kind of it's kind of like topping, but in right now I'm about to he up this top. This is really my one of my first times doing this. It's, it's a new experience for me. But I believe God's with me, so we're gonna continue. Here it goes. You might not the chainsaw might not you might not be able to hear with the chainsaw so Okay. Espérate, espérate. 
chime in and explain what happened in this situation this was a beginner's mistake I made the wrong call I was trying to prevent the branch from swinging it was at the outside of the tree and I wanted to prevent it from swinging aggressively to the center because my tie-in point was in the center and I was I was on the outside of the tree and there is nothing to catch the branch from swinging hard so what I did is, at first I thought about grabbing the blue one, and I'll show you here in a minute what I mean, but I ended up grabbing the pink one, the ring and ring pink one instead of the, the loopy sling uh, ring, because I thought, I thought once the branch was going to come down, um, the, the force of the branch was going to cause the ring and ring to stay, stay down, but I was wrong. I should have grabbed the blue one, the looped one, and it would have it would have cinched around that branch that I cut, and it would have held in place. All in all, it wasn't nothing too major. It was just a learning experience for me, but that was my intention. The reason why I put it underneath my cut is so that it could hold the branch from swinging, from swinging to the middle. And I was hoping that it would it would have caught the ring ring and go straight down but that's what happened in that scenario I just used the wrong I used the wrong I used the wrong ring see right there it slips out of the branch when the branch is cut
quería jalar por eso la quería jalar para eso así como ahorita
Thank you for watching. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make His face shine upon you and be gracious to you. May the Lord lift up His countenance upon you and give you peace. In Jesus' mighty name, God bless.